Target 7 investigations only on your hometown station, WDBJ7. Views from home. Brought to you by Air 7. The news on your hometown station, WDBJ7, starts right now. Now on WDBJ7, June is Gun Violence Awareness Month. How the Roanoke Police Department is bringing attention to gun violence prevention and education efforts. Well, it's a dry and warm start to the weekend, but that might not be the case on Sunday. Coming up, we'll track who exactly might see some showers. Plus, organizations are coming together for a benefit motorcycle ride in memory of a 35-year-old firefighter who lost his battle with cancer. How organizers hope to honor Jeremy Compton and raise money for his family. Good Saturday morning. Thank you so much for waking up with us. So we're having a great start to your day. I'm Sophia Borelli. And I'm Tanisha Jackson. It's a beautiful day so far yes. this morning. Exactly. And it looks like we're going to be getting some drier weather. Yeah, I will say stepping outside this morning, it was nice and cool, Peyton. Yeah. Like really that good temperature of just, you know, being able to go outside and uh, yeah, it looks like we're going to warm up today, though. Yeah, I know we'll warm up and it's going to feel hot, but we don't have the mugginess that we had just a few days ago. So that feels really nice, right? It doesn't feel swampy or sticky outside. So I don't know about you, but I'll take the dry heat any day. Right now, a lot of us in the 50s as we're waking up this morning. Lewisburg is at 49, though. Galex 56, Martinsville 50 degrees. Now, that's all due to the, of course, less relative humidity or lower dew points. So dew points reading in the 40s for a lot of us, some low 50s as we get closer to the Roanoke Valley, but that classifies as comfortable air. So not quite super dry, right? We're not looking at dew points into the low 40s or 30s like the winter time, but we are certainly way more comfortable because earlier this week we were in the 70s at some points for dew points. So highs today into the upper 80s. This is slightly warmer than yesterday. I did put 86 degrees for Roanoke. Danville could even reach 88 degrees. Yesterday we were only at 84, so you can see that difference that we're noticing there. Now let's talk rain chances. Nothing today. I really think a lot of us will stay dry besides some increasing clouds, but Sunday we do have a slight chance of some showers and we'll track that for you coming up. Thanks, Peyton. We begin this morning in Spotsylvania where a woman suspected in a triple homicide has been arrested after a two day search. 23 year old Alyssa Venable was arrested after a car chase in Steuben County, New York, which is near the Pennsylvania border. New York police used a tire deflation tool to stop her car, resulting in a crash. 